Hey guys, so it's time for this month's Transgender Spotlight. And this month's Transgender Spotlight is going to the one and only Will Copeland. Now, Will Copeland is a female to male transgender, you know. Um, the first time I heard Will Copeland's story was um, on campus. Um, Will Copeland did a series of interviews, and some of them were actually radio interviews. And he spoke upon his trans experience how. You know, he isn't, you know, defined by his masculinity. He's not defined, you know, by what he wears, what he wears and things like that. But Will Copeland is saying that being trans is how you feel on the inside. And he was ready to express himself on the outside. Now, I'm not 100% sure. It's been a while since I heard the story. But I know that Will Copeland comes from a big family. I think that he was his mom's only daughter at the time, and now that she's transi transitioned, so all she has is sons. Um, I remember back when I first heard this story and I was looking at pictures of Will Copeland, I was like, well, which one, you know, is the transgender? Because Will Copeland looks very good. I have to admit, I thought he was extremely handsome. I still do. But um, Will Copeland is definitely another influencer in the LGBTQ community. You know, Will Copeland, um, doing a series of radios, um, interviews, and things like that, you know, inspire a lot of people to want to come forth to their parents to want to take that step. And although I believe um, Will Copeland was from a small town, he decided to break that barrier and come out and, you know, be honest and genuine with who he is and who he was in that moment, you know. We have to follow our own paths. I think Will Copeland's story, if anything, can teach people that what you feel in the inside is okay. You know, you're not hurting anyone, you're not harming anyone, you're just trying to express yourself via appearance. You know, we feel this way on the inside. We shouldn't feel boxed in or, you know, like like we're doing wrong. Like a person wants to color their hair purple, green, orange, you know, and change it every day if they want to. You should have the free will to do that. And I think that's Will Copeland's message to simply you know, express yourself, if you will. Um, you're not harming anyone, and it'll actually help you become more of a freer being and a freer person. So I totally back Will Copeland's message, and I just wanted to give you a spotlight because you are a, a, um, a transgender influencer for the community. Thank you, Will Copeland. And remember, guys, if you want to see who's going to be on the transgender spotlight next month, simply subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.